Hi students, um, this is Miss Ng here. Today I'm going to teach you how to answer some statistics question. Um, what you see on the board here is a question posted by one of my students. It was emailed to me. It's a statistics question. Yeah, um, There are two. The first one is here and I'm going to show it to you. Right. Um, it's given in a table, there's a frequency table, and if you can see, um, this is ungrouped data. Ungrouped data means that uh, there is no range. This is your data, right? You must first be able to tell the data is number and the frequency is here. So the data, there's no range, so it's ungrouped, yeah? Okay, then let's look at the question. The table above shows a set of number arranged in descending order. So the key word is here, it is arranged in descending order where n is a positive integer yeah it's a positive integer of course uh, it cannot be negative since it is between 10 and 1 it's arranged in descending order all right then they say express the median of the set in term of n all right median the first thing is you have to know median is the number that is in the middle that is in the middle if it is arranged yeah if it is arranged properly so let's look at it first how many numbers are there how many datas are there how many data um so you add up all the frequency yeah so to do a let's write it here to do a we add up all the frequency um so total frequency would equals to um if you add all of them up there will be 10. so median yeah is you have to, if it is in an ungrouped data, to find the median and the data is an even number. There are 10. 10 is even number of data. You have to do 10 plus 1 divided by 2. That gives you 5.5. So this tells me that the median is the fifth data, the fifth data plus the sixth data divided by 2. That means the median or the number that is in the middle is somewhere between the fifth and the sixth number arranged in ascending or descending order. Okay, now, so let me explain this to you. I know a lot of students don't understand this, even though you have learned this in Form 3. Okay, the best way for you to understand this is, to, is through illustration, and the illustration is this. There are 10 numbers. Say I'm going to draw 10 numbers. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. There are 10 numbers. So what are the, what arrange in ascending or descending order? So what is the number that is in the middle? That is right smack in the middle. Yeah. So right smack in the middle is this. Um, there are 5 here. A lot of people think 5 is the is the number in the middle. 10 divided by 2 is 5. Ma, so 5. So it's not correct. Yeah. Say if you say 5 is the number that is in the middle. And you look over here to the left. How many numbers are there to the left? Four. How many numbers are there to the right? Five. Is it balanced? Is five actually right in the middle of this data? It is not. So when there is even set of number, see this number, there's ten numbers here. If it is even, you cannot just take 10 divided by 2 and get 5 and say 5 is in the middle. It is not even anymore. So you will have to can you you will have to add 1 to the set of data. So 11 divided by 2 is 5.5 because 5.5 tells you that the data is between 5 and 6. The fifth and the sixth data is here. This. So now it is balanced. To the right is four numbers, to the left, four numbers. So whatever that is between the fifth and the sixth data actually is here, right smack in the middle. Yeah, right smack in the middle, let's draw it down here. So whatever that is between the fifth and the sixth data will be the median. So let's just look the fifth and the sixth data, yeah? This is a range in descending, so you count backwards, yeah? Count backwards, so the first, the second data would be here. The third, the fourth, and the fifth would be here. The third, the fourth, and the fifth will be here, yeah? Alright? So the third, the fourth, and the fifth. So the fifth is this, and the sixth will be this. So the fifth data is n minus 1 right here, right? And the sixth data is the data after it. Uh, the, the sixth and the seventh data is number 6, actually. So the fifth data, let's write it over here, is n minus 1. And plus, the sixth data is 6. So divided by 2, and that would be um, n plus 5 over 2. And that's it. This is your answer because it says express the median of the set in terms of n. So your answer should have n in it. Okay, that's it.